is with me. Good morning, Tom. I, I love this. I get to wear this coat when you come in. I, and I think I'm buttoned right. That's a laboratory coat because I am a scientist. <laughs> Good to see well, you. Valentine's Day today. Yes, that's yes, right. Tell yes. me about what we've got okay. going on. Okay. Well, Valentine's Day is a wonderful opportunity to bring in science. One thing that the creator of the Quirkles really tried to emphasize is that every opportunity is a science opportunity. Okay. So we hear we don't have time to teach science. Well, we challenge uh, the teachers that they do. They can even do it during parties and other science special all events. Around us. So today, uh, what I've been doing with the kids this week is asking them if they are in love. And of okay. course, they, no, no, no. Oh, no. And we say, yeah. well, the science yeah. doesn't lie. Yeah. So let's oh. see. So, Tom, you have, in these cute little Valentine glasses, you have hydrogen peroxide. Now, the hydrogen peroxide is actually what you have to buy at a beauty supply store. Right. If, if you try this at home or at school, the regular drugstore hydrogen yeah. peroxide will not work. This yeah. is 40 volume, the kind that you use when you're dyeing your hair. Right. And you want grown-up supervision on this Absolutely, stuff. absolutely, always. Now, in your cup of water, okay. and it needs to be warm water, but not too cup warm, put your yeast in your cup of water, please. The whole thing? Uh, yes. All go right, ahead. there you go. And stir it up. I'm going to take a stir stick. Yes, I'm sorry. I didn't That's right. That's oh, okay. And stir it up there. Now, just for effect, we're going to use... The Dawn dishwashing liquid. Oh, Everyone yeah, knows okay. I love Dawn. Yes, you do. So we're going to put a little Dawn dishwashing liquid in there. And then also, just to have a lot of fun, let's just put the red food coloring in Mix there. Mix that up too. Mix it up. Ooh. Now, yeah. I will also tell viewers that the yeast, be sure that it is new yeast. I have done this before where my yeast has not been active and it does uh -huh. not work so uh -huh. this is one of those that it's a little temperamental but it's a lot okay. of fun right. okay Your now yeast. let's take our mixture and yes. pour it in our hydrogen peroxide and let's see if we are in love oh my goodness oh Definitely is that what that means? The, the love says, my love <laughs> overflows for oh, you. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Yeah, isn't that cool? Uh-oh, and it continues to yes, overflow. Yes, it does. Is in fact, now what we actually did, Tom, the hydrogen peroxide makeup is H2O2. So we released that extra extra oxygen molecule. Two oxygen, two yes, hydrogen. The, the yeast acts as a catalyst and brings the oxygen out of the the hydrogen peroxide. So Man, it's you're, a going wonderful, you're going to overflow yeah, with we your are love. Overflowing, that's right. It also, if you will fill the fill the bottom of your pan, if you can, it is warm. Oh yeah. That's because you are getting a thermal reaction. It creates heat. So it's just a lot of science going. And you can see it's it's safe to touch. Now I certainly wouldn't put it all over your face yeah. or hands, but yeah. it's it's perfectly safe to touch. And the kids just go crazy over this. So but don't this, get it in your hair. Long, no, well, yeah, no, <laughs> probably not. <laughs> not now, mine anyway. Yeah, so let's just keep that over <laughs> here because we have our love overflows, but now let's okay. do our love for you grows and grows. Okay. So in our bottle, this looks like water. It is not. It Ooh. is vinegar. So you do not want to drink it, obviously. Well, but if you have a salad now, handy, it's all right. You have a red balloon. Yes, I do. I have a pink balloon. Okay. Let's take your spoon, and I'm sorry I keep taking you here. You take the clean spoon. Okay, I'll do take that. Take your spoon and put your baking soda inside, and it doesn't have to be exact. Put some inside your balloon. Yeah. I Okay, we got about now, 30 seconds here. Another love test. Now, again, just for fun, let's make our vinegar, excuse me, Tom, okay. let's make our vinegar red. I All just right. think it's fun. Let's make it real valentine -y. Now, we released the oxygen in the last one. In okay. this one, we are going to have a chemical reaction with carbon dioxide. So put, put it over the, the top. balloon okay. over the top. And this is where you pray <laughs> you don't get a hole in it because now sometimes boy, that howdy. happens. Yep. All right. And on the count of three, okay. we are going to lift up the balloon and let the baking soda fall down Let's with the do vinegar. It. One, two, three, and lift it up. And oh, hold, hold your balloon up, Tom. I'm, 
Don't be afraid of it. That's okay. Let your love grow. Yes. <laughs> like a mountain there you stream. Go. That's right. Let you, hey, they should make a song about that. Let your I'll love see what grow. I can do. Okay. There you go. So a lot of fun. Carbon dioxide, oxygen. It's a great way to get kids involved on Valentine's Day or any other day for that matter. It's all about the quirkles. How do they reach you? They can reach us on our website, quirkles.com, at uh, Goldmines IPA and at Fiction Packs and Fun. This thing's going to blow up yeah. any second All now. Right. Back yes, to you guys.